Hi, my name is Brett Latham. I'm from Sydney, Australia, and I'm the coach of the Australian Reef Sharks, with a beach team going to uh, WCBU in France, and I'm also going to Russia uh, to help you guys. What do you consider to be your greatest achievement in Ultimate? Will, let's go, I've been a part of right Ultimate for 12 years. Right, Probably my greatest achievement would be uh, helping uh, my university club, Sydney University, uh, develop and become a powerful Ultimate Frisbee club within Australia. And we're now two-time champions, and we're looking at getting a third uh, national title. <laughs> What's your most memorable Ultimate tournament? My most, most memorable Ultimate tournament is probably the last uh, Beach Worlds in Dubai. Uh, it was such a well-run tournament and it enabled me to uh, really perform at my best and the org it was so organized that uh, everyone had such a good time as soon as they were off the field and on the field I achieved all my goals and uh, played pretty well. We ended up coming eighth and uh, we're really looking forward to having a go at improving that this year. What, what is your position on the field? I'm usually a defensive receiver. Uh, I like that because uh, I get to run. I get to run a lot. And uh, I like the responsibility that's involved in getting a D for my team uh, and then backing up and trying to score it in the end zone. I uh, try to catch my play by the surprise and uh, run as soon as there's a turn. What do you do when you're not playing ultimate? When I'm not playing ultimate, uh, I'm a teacher. I teach primary school. 10-year-olds uh, and uh, they know more about Ultimate than many other children their age and I feel like a lot of skills from teaching uh, transition over to coaching and uh, sometimes my players see that when I give them games and tasks just like 10-year-olds. Uh, why do you want to take part in the Russian training camp? I'm really interested to see what the uh, Russian ultimate scene is like and and see how uh, the players in Russia differ to Australian players and uh, try and try and not only help uh, show what ultimate in Australia is like but also have a lasting impression and help the teams uh, in Russia uh, develop themselves uh, after all of our coaches uh, leave back to their countries. Do you have any teaching or coaching experience? I've been coaching for about seven years and I've learned a lot in that time. Actually, coaching uh, Ultimate Frisbee made me want to become a teacher and uh, I think skills that I learn in coaching have helped me in teaching as well as uh, teaching, transitioning back into coaching. Uh, I think the most important thing is developing relationships with the players so that you can get the most out of them and, and having them trust you as much as you trust them when they're out on the field performing what you want them to perform. Is there anything specific you want to try and do during your visit to Russia? Uh, I'd like to try the vodka. Uh, I think uh, I've been told some interesting things uh, about the architecture as well, but I think I'm most interested in seeing Russia from uh, a Russian perspective. So meeting the people, meeting uh, the players. I think ultimate players all over the world are, are pretty similar in their ideals and uh, I'm, I'm really excited to see Russia from your point of view. What, what's some things you already know about Russia? Uh, I've played against the Russians uh, on the beach uh, a few times in the past, I think three times in the past and they've always given us really, really fantastic games. Uh, so I know that they're fantastic at Ultimate already. Um, in terms of the Russian culture, uh, I think I'm waiting to see uh, what they can show me. So I think my time at the camps is really going to set, set the uh, standard for what I think uh, Russians are like. Sweet. Cool. Thanks.